very nice music. Just to look for the level of details you have on that. Including the dynamic lightning or the particle effects. And just, just imagine that now the chip is consuming around one and a half volts. Yeah, it's just it's unbelievable you can do today with mobile devices. So this game is coming as well soon. You mean games? Yeah, yeah. So I think it Five looks pretty cool if you just the game thing is running from the mobile device. Yeah. All these backgrounds. So then I can show you when we're talking about the Diablo. There is a game called Dark Kingdom, which will be released soon. This one is a game which will be soon released. I think it will be like. Can you show months. me the console, the Logitech? One? Yeah, it's a Logitech. But you can play like the PlayStation 3. You okay. can use a Xbox controller, or any controller which use uh, the USB host connection. So it's so. Almost every new game we are releasing now on Tegra has a controller support. Almost, almost every new game, which is very good. I mean, in the future we can easily like you can connect the tablet to your TV and just play it like the console. So this is kind of the Diablo game. It's like hack and slash RPG. Even if you think about the the, the textures. The texture details are very, very crisp and realistic. So even the models are very complex for again if you play on the on the chip, which is basically mobile one. This is just the you know demo, so it's not a full game. So it basically it's only one level, but it still looks pretty cool. There are some glitches, like for example, when you loading this takes this time. I still don't have all the all the. Yeah, now I just kill him. So let's go down. We can fight some bosses. This one is pretty big. See that there is as well some physics simulations. Wow, now we, we, we are getting some really big boss here. <laughs> There's very good music inside, I was just surprised, it's very dark and Kill him. So I think it's a pretty good demonstration what you can expect uh, from the devices, maybe the last one, what I have here. You just have to think, I had many discussions with guys, they basically telling me like, uh, well, this my PC can do it as well, but you have to keep in your mind that this is basically phone chip. Yeah, so we're talking about uh, something which consuming like 100 times, maybe 200 times less than your PC. So if you just think about the level of graphics you can get out of this, in compare uh, how much it's eating and how efficient it is. It's a pretty impressive thing. So you see that the uh, frame rate is very smooth. Dark Meadow, Dark Meadow is just kind of the horror game. So let's go here. Or oh, there will be some thing demons 
not sure if I can go in this direction, but you see, I think it's pretty impressive, isn't it, for a mobile yeah. game? Yeah. So you see, I have a tons of games here I can showcase. We can see there like whole afternoon. So. <laughs> I think it's it's very smooth. I mean, it's using as well lots of the effects, and it's just you will get the same same graphics on a on a tablet like on a, on a consoles, which I guess it's it's itself impressive. So, what do you think? So.